Hello John In this video I'm going to show you how to make A script that can bomb someone's email And it works It really does So don't abuse it It's just for, you know, educational purposes <laughs> So go ahead to your script editor Make a, a new file and save it somewhere um, since I'm using what the since I'm using XAMPP, I'll save it in that default thing, you know, the default path. We'll call this YouTube.php. So on our file, go ahead, open some PHP tags, like that. And first thing I want to do is make a variable called one well it's called mail call it one okay now we're gonna use this as our counter and we're gonna increase it in a loop and if you don't know what that means just follow along anyway so we're gonna make a loop a do while loop so do while condition this basically, whatever is in here, we're gonna keep repeating until this condition's met. <coughs> Excuse me. So, gonna do this a while. Mail is less than, say, 500. Since this is our counter, right, we're gonna keep going until it's under, well, until it's 500. So in this part, the actual loop, we need to increase it for each iteration that we're going to bomb this person's email. So mail plus increase increment plus plus. All right. So basically, this is going to, well, you can see what it's going to do. So now for the mailing part, make a variable called rand. It's going to be just a random MD5 string like that. Let's make another one called message. Whoops. And it's also MD5 random. And then some from. Well, call it FRM. MD5 rand. These are basically going to be random strings that will spoof headers inside the email so that for email clients like Gmail the emails aren't collapsed into a single email they'll be treated as separate emails so we'll say to bob at i hate bob dot com because we hate him so we're going to send them this all the stuff subject the subject <coughs> will be one of these random strings like that simple message the message of this email will also be another random string like different of the other ones and then from f r o m will be a string with a random string at a random url like this rand at f r m dot com. The point of all this is to treat these emails as unique senders. So <coughs> headers from and then append from. That's gonna be in the header of the email. The header data. So now we're at the part where we actually send the mail using PHP's send mail function like this mail and it takes these parameters in this order to subject message headers and that's it and if you ever want to use this echo done and when you see that you're done, you know that all this has completed. 
Now I'm not going to test this in this video, but this does work. You can try it yourself. And um, yeah, see you later. Mate.